The show today is actually a special. I'm not sure if I pointed that out to you. Did I tell you that? Did I tell you that today's show is a special? Oh, yeah. It's the uh, Richard and Mary Jane Green special today. Oh, God. Your mom and dad. Yeah. See, last week on the program, we went and woke up my father at 3 o'clock in the morning because my mother had gone away on a holiday. I thought he might be lonely. So we were wondering, and a lot of people were wondering why my father didn't get mad at me. He seemed to enjoy the, uh, the wake-up performance that we gave him. And, uh, and, and they said, people said to me, you know, Tom, your father never seems to get mad when you do these things to him. Well, we actually uh, dug up some old footage that we'd never aired before from in the summer. Uh, this is the time that my parents uh, did get mad when they went on their canoe trip. Oh, yeah. We'll be right back. They're really mad. Get ready for the big trip. Resting up for the big trip. My dad and my mom and their friends are going to Algonquin Park on Sunday. See, every day you have to water this plant, okay? Okay. It's in the plastic container. It's not mine. It's Mr. Fauché's. The plastic container is Mr. Fauché's? No, the fuchsia is Mr. Fauché's. So all of these ones... So because you guys are going away to Algonquin Park, the neighbors all brought their plants over for me to water? That's right. And uh, I want to prove to you that I'm mature enough to live alone. Uh, here without supervision for a week. And I'm going to do that this week. Uh, you can prove it. If, if all those plants are alive when we get back, mm -hmm. that, that would be the... That would uh, be, the uh, 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 be prepared to come <laughs> home and find that I've gone above and beyond the call of oh, duty. Oh, you mean the grass would, might be cut The grass cut will be cut. Great. Hedges trimmed. We have this on film. On yeah. film. Yeah, great. Hedges too. Yeah. Oh. I'm going to get some paint and uh, go above and beyond the call of duty in the chores department for my parents and uh, I've decided to paint their house for them for a little surprise. I think my parents will be happy when they come home and see that I've done some work around the house and not just laced around on my ass all week. couldn't afford uh, the fee for for art like that. No, we could, we could do it. They'd probably be so, so surprised and overwhelmed they'd likely faint after they see it. I hoped my parents would like their surprise. I painted, I worked all week while they were gone on their trip. The house looked better than all the other houses in the neighborhood. The other neighbors must have been so jealous. But my brother didn't think my parents would like their surprise. What the hell are you doing, Tom? What? What are you doing? What do you mean? In the house. Well, Mom said we sh they wanted us to do chores around the house while they were gone. Never said to do that. I thought it'd be nice to go above and beyond the call of duty. Whatever. Why don't you don't track any paint into the house? <laughs> When my dad find out about this, Tom, you're f***ing gone. Well, I think they're going to find out. It's for them. Even though my brother had warned me, I kept working on the house. I knew my parents were going to be proud. I knew my mom and dad were going to love it. It was going to be the best house in the whole world. Rock. That's what I thought until they got home the next day. There he was, the car pulled up. It looked like he liked it at first. I thought my mom kind of liked it too, but, well, I, well. You painted the house? Oh, marvelous. Have you got a job and a half? The car is gone. I did all the lawn too, I watered my the plants. Car. My water car, plants. my car will be sold, I'm calling the guy. What do you mean, what are you talking about? You have two days to get that painted back. What are you talking about painted back? Paint, painted white, the way it was. That's what are you talking about painted white? I just worked two days painting it. This couldn't be, be happening. What it can mean? be happening. Yeah. My dad was what threatening to, to sell my car, the car that he bought for me. My, my car. He, you can't sell my car. I did it to be nice. I painted the house to be nice, Dad. Sold. Sold car. No. Yeah. What are you talking about? Car is sold. Dad, I worked hard here. I worked hard here, Dad. <laughs> I worked hard here on this. Car is sold. 
I worked hard here on this. I worked all day on this. Yeah. Should at least say thank you. Sold car. Should at least say thank you, Dad. It's not fair. Look at this. Look at all the work. Look at all the, what the uh, brushes. Oh, that's a goalie. I made a goalie for you. Yeah. Stop burglars. My dad didn't like the house, he didn't like the wooden goalie, and you think that's bad? My mom wouldn't even talk to me. Here she is hiding in the washroom, hiding behind the door, and you want to see how many times she slammed that door right in my face? Why? Yeah, what? Get out of here. Mom, it looks nice. You like that kind of art stuff. Look at the way you did the ducks along the top of the, the washroom. You know? That's kind of like what I did on the house. It's like the ducks in the washroom. Yeah. Oh, come look at the house with me, Mom. It looks nice. Why? What? I ran this house. I ran this house like a well-oiled engine, a machine for a week. Nothing went wrong. I did all the chores, mowed the lawn. Went out in the backyard. I even went so far as painting the house. I make it home. I'm not grateful. I guess I understand my parents. I understand them more now. And I painted the house white again. They ignored my hard work, but at least I got my car back.